I mean, New Zealand and Australia did a terrible job with COVID compared to the ideal. Uh, I never thought we would be. And what is the factor? I mean, there's actually a number on this stuff. I mean, I believe we're 50,000 times worse. I mean, it, it, it's un, unspeakable numbers. I never thought that um, our citizens' irresponsible behavior could um, could do this much damage. I mean, we're able to actually look at the numbers. And I suppose um, you can argue about blaming Trump, and that would be a reasonable argument. You could argue about blaming um, libertarian thought and individualism. You could argue about who you're blaming. But I think it's you can't argue that somehow our culture, who we are, uh, killed 50, 75,000 people that probably didn't have to die. I mean, I'm, I'm not an expert, but my friends who are epidemiologists, and I have a couple of them, um, they're able to put a number on it. And I think when you, when you look back, uh, when we look back at 1917, we see, um, the very, very, uh, stupid, People who fought against masks then and had coughing parties uh, for who could cough the loudest and the most as the, you know, the biggest disaster in human history happened, you know, the 1917 flu. And um, we've improved so much since in this hundred years. You know, we've, we've decreased the violence. We've decreased the hunger. We've decreased so much of the suffering. We've turned up the empathy. We've turned up the compassion. And I would have thought we would have handled this uh, better. Not perfectly, but I thought we would have done as well as Australia. I mean, they had the Bee Gees. We had Dylan. 